Hey there folks, Tim Slade here from eLearning Uncovered. In this video, I want to show you how you can easily animate the hover states for your buttons in Articulate Storyline. This effect is a great way to make the look and feel of your buttons a bit more interesting. To create this effect, I'll start by adding a standard button to my slide. From there, I need to edit the hover state for this button. Now because states are multiple variations of a single object, I can't simply add an animation to the hover state of this button. However, I can add animations to other objects within this state. So next, I'm going to add the object that I'd like to have animate when the hover state of this button is shown. In this case, I'll add a small square across the top of the button and make it a contrasting color like white. Finally, all I need to do is add the entrance and exit animations to this object. You can use any of the animation types you want, and I would highly encourage you to experiment with the different animations to see what types of effects you can create. Now in this case, I'll use the wipe entrance and exit animations, and I'll set it to wipe in from the left and wipe out from the right. And that's it! I'll click Done Editing States, and let's preview it to see how it looks. As you can see, the object we added to the hover state animates in when I hover over the button and animates out when my mouse moves away. Now in this case, I'd like the animations to occur just a bit faster, so I'll simply go back to editing the hover state of this button and adjust the duration of the entrance and exit animations I applied earlier. As you can see, this technique can be used to create many, many different hover effects for your buttons, and that's how you easily animate the hover states for your buttons in Articulate Storyline. Enjoy! Hey, did you like that video? Make sure to check out some of our other great content at elearningandcovered.com. Follow us on Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, you know the drill, just check out our stuff.